Woods now where it's some damage there as a result. A lot of reports of trees and power lines down, and that boat let go, so-called, because it's got this sort of a C shape here, plunged southward into D.C., but has been weakening. That's been the good news in this situation. There's a closer look at it. Again, you see the lightning uh, really beginning to drop off. Still a couple of strikes along 95 there. Heavier rain into Anne Arundel and PG County and down into D.C. And as we take a look at the uh, Doppler radar, we notice that the cells, even as they are weakening, the cold pool that the storms have been forming on continues to drive southward. So still some gusty wind here, probably 40 miles an hour, maybe better, now driving southward along 95 and not very far away from La Plata yes. and Waldorf, Maryland. Awesome. All right, back to the radar we go. You see heavy rain coming through eastern Pennsylvania, a lot of mountainous terrain there, so flash flooding is going to be a concern. And there are some stronger cells that are now moving down 80, one of these generally moving towards... Manhattan, we'll see if it holds together. There's no warning on that cell, but it looks like some thunder at least is going to be headed your way. Broader picture for you now, very strong jet stream blasting up through the middle of the plains. Along with that, we've had a number of very strong storms, and some of those in the Minneapolis area. Uh, there are warnings now, severe thunderstorm warnings in effect in Minneapolis, and then a lot of rain farther south and west, so big concern about flash flooding tonight from Minnesota on south and westward down into Nebraska, and we'll tell you more about those uh, flash flood watches coming up in just a few minutes. Kim, back over to you. Hi, you're watching Hurricane Central. We have continuing live team coverage next with Mike Seidel in Jacksonville Beach, Florida. I'll show you what it looks like right now where he is set up, and it is windy up there tonight. We're seeing tropical storm force winds. Look at the